today I'm demonstrating the Synopsys Designware IP prototyping kit for UFS host with a PCI Express host connection. This kit provides the essential hardware and software elements needed to reduce UFS host IP prototyping and integration effort so you can start implementing the IP in an SOC in minutes. The kit includes the Synopsys Apps DX FPGA-based prototyping system with pre-configured IP and SOC integration logic, a Designware MIPI M5 daughter board, simulation test bench, reference drivers and application examples. This kit also includes a multi-gigabit SERDIS interface card, which creates a four-lane PCI Express bus interface between the Apps DX system and the host PC. Here is the Apps DX system, MIPI M5 daughter board and multi-gigabit SERDIS card for the PCI Express connection. The kit includes an SD card with a Designware JDEC UFS host controller and associated SOC integration logic, which I will plug into the Apps DX system. The MIPI M5 daughter board allows you to connect the hardware prototype to real-world devices like this UFS memory evaluation board with an MMCX connector. All IP development kits are compatible with most software development tools, so software engineers can start driver and firmware development in their preferred environment. To see the IP prototyping kit in action, I will first power on the kit and PC. For this demo, I will use a PC with Linux to build the pre-verified drivers provided with the kit. The drivers are built as modules for PCI Express link connection and debug or test applications. I will install the kernel modules into the Linux kernel. To communicate with the UFS memory evaluation board, I will change the MFI RXTX and controller settings to operate with the required lanes and gears. I'll check to ensure that the settings have been applied correctly. Finally, I will mount the drive and access the memory. On to a real-world example. I will stream a video from the UFS memory evaluation board through the IP prototyping kit to display on the monitor. Synopsys provides this application example and related source code within the IP prototyping kit so that designers can modify, update or even create their own application to suit their needs. The IP prototyping kit allows you to quickly and easily explore many different scenarios. As you can see, this kit works fine out of the box. However, designers can modify the IP configuration for their own applications using a set of tools for a fast iteration flow. This flow uses the Synopsys Core Consultant tool with a simple GUI to change the configuration, generate RTL and verify the IP integration using the simulation test bench environment, all in about one hour. Core Consultant allows designers to change or select the configuration through a simple GUI. This intuitive interface guides you through the available options for fast reconfiguration turnaround time. When you are finished, clicking Apply generates the RTL. The IP prototyping kit includes the protocompiler DX GUI used for design synthesis or tickle scripts to expedite the process and complete the place and route. Once the design is modified and reloaded in the SD card, you can check key internal signals and status registers. The IP prototyping kit comes pre-instrumented to capture relevant signals using deep trace debug. This capability gives designers the ability to view several seconds of waveforms to speed up debug interactions. This is done by taking advantage of 8GB DRAM on the Apps DX system. The DRAM captures RTL waveforms that can be viewed on popular hardware debuggers, such as Synopsys Verdi or most other waveform viewer tools. After you have completed your software and hardware development, the IP prototyping kits can easily connect through an AXI tunnel to a HAP70 platform, creating a large SOC prototype. You have seen how the Designer IP prototyping kit for UFS host provides immediate productivity for both hardware engineers and software developers. Thank you for watching.